This is in the box, a hockey card show. So this is usually the part where I kind of give a little bit away as to what to expect on the show. What if I didn't want to do that this time? The one thing that a lot of people tell me is, you know, we never figure out what exactly it is that you don't want to tell us. Like, <laughs> when I really want to hide something, good luck, you'll never figure it out. I won't even drop you a hint. <laughs> it's ruthless. Well, just means you're going to have to watch the rest of the episode to figure that out there, bud. However, if you do want to come along for the ride through my journey in the world of collecting hockey cards the way that I believe it was intended, just go ahead, click subscribe. That way I can get the show started right now. So who is ready for the new NHL season? I mean, I would say go ahead and raise your hand, but there would be absolutely no way for me to know who did and who didn't. However, I mean, you could leave it in the comments. That is... That's one way of knowing. And as we all know, Utah made it into the NHL. Therefore, I'm a little excited to see how their inaugural season will pan out. But you also know what else there is to look forward to, don't you? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, if you don't, I don't know why you're on this channel. Just saying. New NHL hockey card releases. <laughs> oh! <laughs> That's right, Fred. And speaking of cards... Back into the swing of things, and we have got more nine pocket pages yet to go through, sent in by Tank Sports. And it goes without fail that there is always some kind of message or something that he sends along the way. And today, we stumbled upon this. Oh, yeah. I can feel the love. <laughs> so without further ado, let's just get right into the pages. Starting with this, let's go. We have got some SP Top Rookies. I got a couple of blue in there. And a nice Jason Robertson limited as well. Another limited of Pawlowski. Flip. And here we go. We got a nice Chase Pierce. Actually, two Chase Pearsons. Ice rookie. And tough times right there in the corner of Shane Sherla. Next page. And I'm trying to get through as many as I possibly can. On this episode, see if we can get a nice big chunk completed. Flip. Here we go. Here we go. Nice Conor McDavid Superstar Showcase. And some 90s. Tyler Benson MVP rookie in there as well. Red Wings page coming up. We got a nice Mantha there. Sunset Parallel. Nice Sergey Fedorov as well. Another Mantha. Look at that. And flip. All right. All right. I definitely need these uh, ice rookies here. Let's go. We got tons more. So let's check things out. A lot of these I'm sure that we've seen time and time again. But I'm loving it because, as I mentioned prior... A lot of these are going to fill in some gaps into the PC. Especially those UD Canvas. Still working on a lot of those sets. Next page. Look at that. I'm already seeing one. I know I do not have this beautiful Welcome to Los Angeles. And the Jordan Spence Future Watch Spectrum Effects. What else we got? What else we got? Just a nice chunk of stuff, guys. Oh, got my overtime in there. Clappers. Eric Stahl. Oh, look at that. I thought that was just a base at first until I saw it shining at me at the member's choice. Stadium Club. Still with me? Good, because we still have more to go. Let's check out this next page here. Los Angeles. And nothing really screaming out at me on this one.
And Matt Boldy, SP top rookies. Minnesota up next. We have got a Duhame rookie from Platinum. And a nice Caprice off right there on a roll. Marco Rossi and the SP top rookies. Addison and Beckman in there with the rookies. Nashville, welcome to. Loving the UD canvas as well. Likely need those. Very nice. More Nashville Predators. And it looks like we have got some Future Watch Limiteds right there. That's all right. That'll fit in quite well. And on the other side, what else do we have here? We've got a nice Scotty Upshaw right there, rookie from Exclusive. And a blue surge of P.K. Subban. Little bit of a roll with the uh, Nashville stuff, so let's just keep things rolling. Got a Forsberg Green from Ice. Flip things around, see what else we got here. Got the Showstoppers, Chris Osgood. Oh, that's that's an older one right there. Sorokin as well in the Limited and the Holographics as well. And good old Garth Snow. <laughs> wow, it's been a while since I've heard that name. New Jersey making an appearance. We've got a couple of 90s cards here, none of which I need. Claude Lemieux in there, Ken Danico. And some Ottawa Senators and uh, <laughs> New York Rangers. <laughs> Just Thurkin in there. We got another Panarin with the uh, Blue Surge. A couple of UD portraits as well. Senators coming up next. We've got a nice chunk of the pageantry stuff. And a Stutzla SPA Limited. Oh, liking that pageantry red right there as well. I don't have very many of those. Flip her around. Let's see what else we got. Looks like a good chunk of the SPA Limited on this side here. Very cool. Very cool. Last page of the bunch. Looks like we got some more Limited in here. Brady Kachuk. We got a nice Debrinket here too. Pageantry Red. Cole Reinhardt. Limited. And last part, ooh, got that nice blue surge, Connor Brown. Other side, looks like we've got some Philadelphia Flyers, some 90s in here. Chris Tierney in there with the rainbow. Stutzla once again, and that's where we're ending it off. Connor Brown in that corner, the same corner as the previous side. The runner-up for today's episode falls onto this Pacific Trading Cards. 2002-2003 exclusive, the Scotty Upshaw rookie. I was a huge fan of Pacific trading cards and their brands. However, with this one, it was susceptible to chipping just because some of their cards had um, a lot of foil on the front. Therefore, they did chip an awful lot, if you can see at the very top here along the edge. So they were very hard to come across in absolute mint condition, but our Beautiful cards, nonetheless, as you can see, that cool foil effect in the back really made the player pop out. But today's card of the episode's got to fall in the bread, man. We have got <laughs> Artemi Panarin on this OPG Platinum Blue Surge. Um, I'm a fan of this, of this subset. I think it's really flipping cool. Actually, many of the subsets in, uh, in Platinum... Specifically, the uh, the parallels are pretty flippin' nice. And today had to go in this one's favor. And that's why it's today's card of the episode. Now, if you enjoyed that, I think it's safe to say I have got maybe one episode remaining before we can say we finally completed that bundle. My thanks going out to Tank Sports for sending that stuff in because it's going to keep me busy putting all that stuff into my PC. If you haven't done so already, I strongly urge that you click that bell notification button so you're aware the next time a video drops. As unpopular as it is, it still can be done without going bankrupt because collecting does not have to break the bank. And until we meet here once again, 
I want you to keep that amazing collection of yours growing. So stay healthy and safe. Take care of each other. And let's keep this amazing hobby going strong and fun. Take care. We'll see you next time.